What happens behind the door marked private? What does happen behind the door marked private? And how do the private lives, the loves and the struggles of the higher ups affect those of the people downstairs? There's someone like you in executive suite, William Holden. He fought the schemes and the intrigues of the executive suite. June Allison, right or wrong, he was her man. Barbara Stanwyck, her secret affair changed the lives of the executive suite. Frederick Mark. He was driven by a desire for power at any cost. Walter Pigeon, victim of his wife's ambition. Shelley Winters, the private secretary whose affection for the boss was not so private. Paul Douglas, his business trips were not all business. Billy Calhern, the man about town who played for high stakes. Dean Jagger, he wouldn't trade his soul for a title in the executive suite. Nina Fosh, who knew all of their secrets and also had one of her own. You will meet them all together in one scene after another as their jealousy and deceit, loyalty and pride stir up a whirlpool of emotions in the executive suite. I'm selfish. I'm only interested in loving you. Never stop. I'd fight anything, anyone, even you. If I could make you into someone I can't go on loving. For years, I've been working for it, and now I'm going to get it. But not by Larson. And not without my vote. Look, Lauren, th this is not what you think. I come here because, well, I don't know. It's, well, it's home. I guess it's what keeps me going. She lets me say what I want, be myself. Some people wouldn't understand, but I mean not knowing Sylvia, but you, all I ask of you, this is a fine girl, Lauren, and corner of your mouth. All right, side. What did I ever get out of it but loneliness and sudden death? What did I ever get out of them but the sight of their backs? Bullard gave you everything you have. There wouldn't be any stock if it hadn't been for him. You wouldn't be here at all. I gave him 10 years of my life, and all my love is not enough. <laughs> 